Hello, welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from Italiana.com. And in this video tutorial, I'm going to go through the basic things that you need to get started trading cryptocurrency. Um, so in your crypto journey, there are basic things that you need. Just like a farmer goes to the farm, there are basic tools that the farmer needs to go with in order to you know have a successful harvest at the end of the day. So you as a trader, there are basic tools that you need aside the skills that you are acquiring now learning how to trade there are basic tools that you need to start your trading journey and here are the basic things there are not much so first you need a trading view account and you are going to get this for free and then when you start making money you can subscribe and start paying the monthly subscription of 15 dollars or thereabout and so on and trading view account is what you are looking at right now on my screen it is actually um, a platform that is used to analyze any market that you want to trade let's say you want to trade forex you want to trade crypto and you want to trade stock all of these things that you want to trade this is like all in one platform that is used to analyze any pair of currency that you are going to trade it is true that the cryptocurrency market fluctuates it goes up and down and you can lose money but tools like this with the trading view um, platform you can actually analyze and get used to the movement of a particular pair of currency that you want to trade and that way you can follow and you know give a right prediction to the market you are entering so you need a trading view account and there is a video on how to use the trading view platform and getting started you can start with a free version of it so you're going to get started get this for free and link will be in this video description to actually sign up for an account and then the second thing you need is you need a genuine exchange a trusted exchange you don't just jump into different exchanges and you know start putting your money if anything happens you will be the one losing so you need an exchange to start your crypto journey and getting an account with an exchange it means that you are signing up for either of these exchange that i listed here with okx with KuCoin, and with binance these are the three basic exchanges that i use in trading cryptocurrency and it is the one i recommend for anybody and as a starter what i would recommend you start with is okx except if okx is not available in your country then you can go with kucoin and then if kucoin is not equally available i believe binance will be available in one way or the other this three exchange will be available wherever you find yourself around the world but i personally recommend okx because it is easy to use and then their fees are very low the fees are the charge as against other exchange but you can have an account with these three exchange as well because there are pairs of currency you want to trade in a particular exchange you don't see that pair of currency you will need to go to the other exchange where you have it and trade there but as a beginner just start with okx and as time goes on you can have other accounts so what well, all you need to do to get started is follow the link in the video description sign off for an account and after signing off for an account um, you will need to verify your account by submitting either a government issued id or your international passport or something and whatever that is required in your own country just go ahead and submit those details and your account will be verified if you don't have a verified account with any of these once you create your account if you don't verify them there is no way you can be able to use the platform so i'll go through verifying the the account as an example in a different video but just have it at the back of your mind that in order to trade all of this um in order to trade with any of this exchange you need a verified account and verifying account means you are submitting an id issued by a government a government of your country to this platform in the, it, it, it is called kyc know your customer so if not you will not be able to use any of this platform and the last but not the least things that, that you need on to start your crypto trading journey is actually funds you need to fund after you verify the account you need to fund your account because it is this phone that you use to be doing the buying and selling in the market that is what trading is all about so just like a petty trader in your neighborhood who buys um, a cup of gary and sells that is the same thing we are doing with the cryptocurrency if you are trading cryptocurrency or you want to trade for um uh, foreign currency which is um, um forex and the rest then you need funds to get started 
and the minimum I can recommend is you can start this journey with as low as a hundred dollar but if you want to do this more professionally and you have the fund to get started I recommend that you start with 5k $5,000 $10,000 and above and that way you'll be making a whole lot because the more funds you have on your account the more funds you have on a particular trade and the more profit you make with it but with a hundred dollar you can start your trading journey and grow that hundred dollar from hundred dollar up to a thousand or even a hundred thousand dollars if you know what you are doing that is if you can manage your emotions very well in starting this trading journey so once you're going to go through it once again you need a trading via account and you are getting this for free you need an exchange where you can be trading with and you can sign up with any of this exchange link to all of them will be in the video description and you are getting that for free i personally recommend okf if you are a trader already trading with a particular exchange you need to give OKS a try because it will help you go a long way and after that you will need to verify the account whenever you create the account with OKS, with KuCoin, with Binance you need to verify your account and after you've verified your account you will need to fund the account so I'll go through the process of verifying your account in a different video I'll go through the process of funding your account in a different video and some of the questions a lot of persons may be asking uh, let's say there are restrictions in the use of cryptocurrency in your country you don't need to worry because the cryptocurrency um, when it was built um, the idea behind the cryptocurrency it, it was not meant to deal with banks it was actually to remove third parties that was why um, currencies like the digital currency were created so if we still liaise with our banks and the rest to in order to cash out it means that that aim of removing third parties of removing some expenses that you pay transacting with your bank is defeated so you don't need to you know get worried about if the cryptocurrency will not accept your bank and the rest or you don't your card will not work as soon because through the platform that is introduced by many of these exchanges, which is the P2P platform, you can buy and sell your cryptocurrency using your local currency, even directly to your bank account. So you must not link your bank and then do automatic withdrawals or automatic buying and selling before you can use this platform. So as we progress, I'm going to show you step by step on how to do this, how to buy crypto, how to sell them to your bank, and a lot more that you will get access to in this course. So if you don't have any account with any of these platforms that I've mentioned, TradingView or the exchange you are trading with, just follow the link in the video description to sign up for an account and I will see you in my next video.